China's H-6K bomber carrying two air-launched ballistic missiles was revealed at the Zhuhai Air Show. This is the first time air-launched ballistic missile capable of attacking a U.S. aircraft carrier is officially presented to the public. Before going further, please subscribe to my channel, thank you. The H-6K bomber landed at Zhuhai Airport, causing an instant sensation. The missile have a hypersonic aerodynamic design with four tail fins. The exterior was painted with a decorative yellow stripe. The body was marked with the name 2PZD-21, and both missiles are hung under the wing by large pylons. The missiles do not appear to have a rocket nozzle on its tail, could be just modeler training simulation rounds. Even so, it has sparked global military media attention, indicating that the Chinese bombers are officially equipped with air-launched hypersonic missiles, further improving its ability to attack U.S. aircraft carrier. The 2PZD-21 missile is different from the single huge ballistic missile carried by the H-6N, which was revealed through unofficial channels. The 2PZD-21 is likely to be the domestic military version of the CM-401 anti-ship missile showcased in 2018. They do look almost identical. According to the information of the CM-401 missile, the missile has the design features of multi-trajectory flight control, multi-platform, advanced penetration ability, multiple missiles coordination, and can attack moving ships or fixed targets. Described as an export-oriented missile, the CM-401 is said to employ a near-space orbit trajectory, full hypersonic controllable flight, with a radar-guided terminal diving attack, and can be launched by aircraft, ships or ground vehicles. In Zhuhai, this is the first time the 2PZD-21 or CM-401 appears on a warplane. The hypersonic speed of the CM-401, as well as the fact that it has a variety of flexible trajectories and multiple missile coordination design, make it very unlikely that the U.S. Navy can intercept it. It travels at about four times the speed of sound in the cruise phase and more than six times the speed of sound in the final phase, putting it in the category of hypersonic weapons. The speed is too much for existing U.S. Navy anti-missile systems, no mention it is designed to attack as a herd of multiple missiles. The CM-401 has a twin cone shape and tail fins, but its gas-powered rudder is supposed to be the main device for changing flight conditions, and the body generates corresponding aerodynamic control. The CM-401 could have a range of more than 300 kilometers, making it difficult for U.S. Navy anti-aircraft missiles to attack its carrying aircraft. The official exposure of the 2PZD-21 missile, coupled with the large and medium-sized ballistic missiles launched by the H-6N and 055 destroyers, symbolizes the maturity, scale and diversification of China's ballistic missile weapons against U.S. aircraft carrier battle groups. And its public display at the Zhuhai Air Show is meant to further promote the weapon to other countries. This will have a certain impact on the international balance of military power. Thank you for watching this video, please subscribe, share and comment.